Shalom, Rastafari, Shalom tonight. I'm not just telling to my Ethiopian Hebrew and Rastafari brother and, and sister. And we want to just address this grief issue. Well, it's not a grief issue, it's a very important issue. It's the whole um, misinterpretation of Yeshua HaMoshiach, Yesus Christos, and his teaching, which is the teaching of his majesty. So we say, give I and I the teaching of his majesty, I and I not want no devil's philosophy. But in this situation that we are in as the once lost but now found beta is Israel. For virtually hundreds of years, we know about Willie Lynchism, how to make a slave, we've been learning about um, counterfeit Christianity, how the whole whitewash and how things were perverted. You know, we know about the Caesar, Bogiers, the image, so we know how they whitewash the image of Yeshua of Jesus Christos, the image of the Bain Ha Elohim, the Son of God. But they've also whitewashed the, the teachings, you know, where they whited out things or they have misinterpreted things. So although we as Rastafari, as Ethiopian Hebrews, we can recognize the true humanity of Yeshua HaMoshiach, especially for us because of our Godfather and King of Kings, Kedemawi, what we need to do is really to investigate the word and to get the word right. Remember, this is word power. And a lot of these situations that we have in Rastafari and even amongst those in the Ethiopian World Federation and in different mansions among different ones and ones, we speak about identity and unity and coming together, so forth and so on. The first thing we need to unite on is the teaching of his imperial majesty. That, that is the main frame that provides a solution for all of the rest. But let's get into this in the remaining time we have in, in this vid right here. Now, no doubt you've probably already seen the um, Rasta devil advocate is saying to I and I, well, there's a discussion among some, and this has been um, 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 propelled, provoked, or based on what um, Barbara uh, Makeda, or she might say Makeda, um, Blake Hanna wrote around 2006. Now, we're not going to get into that whole article because we think um, thinks Empress Ma Marina, um, the legal advice attorney for the, the EABIC, otherwise known as Bowel Shanti, she made a very, very good um, um, a rebuttal to the devil's advocate and to, to the, the issues that were presented in that 2006 um, personal opinion of one named Barbara Makita or Makita Blake Hanna, all right? Um, and this is not personal, although some might take this to be personal. This is not a personal thing, you understand, because um, we don't have any personal kind of vibes to the individual, Yovis. However, this is about the teaching of His Majesty and getting the teaching right and exact. Now, in her article, she pointed out after the first paragraph, opening paragraph or so, there was a subsection called Turn the Other Cheek. And some of y'all might recall, we've touched on that